here in Port Clyde. Crews have been continuing to battle this four structure fire for about 12 hours now and the fire continues to destroy these buildings. They're all totaled. Crews were called to the scene at around 11 o'clock on Wednesday night. Chief Smith believes the fire started in the Dipnet restaurant, which he says is now completely gone. The fire then spread to the Monhegan boat line and the Port Clyde General Store. The Dipnet and the Monhegan boat building and the store are all within feet of each other. So it didn't take much to get, get everything going. There were residents in an apartment in one of the buildings when the fire started, but everyone got out safely. Five other fire departments were called to join the St. George Fire Department right away, and three more departments were called within a half hour. Community members came out in support of the first responders, bringing food and water as crews battled the fire throughout the night and this morning. Port Clyde to me is like one of the best communities to ever live in. It brings tears to my eyes to see how people want to help. As the flames continue to burn, the destruction of these buildings have left locals devastated. Helpless. Really wanted to stop it. So it's heartbreaking for me. And it's heartbreaking for the community. Crews are expected to continue to battle the flames for most of the day today. In St. George, I'm Kate McCusker for Maine Total Coverage.